Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel, Copper with the Moms. This is here today, and today I'm going to share with you guys DIY activities that you can do for your kids on a road trip. So, first thing I'm going to share with you guys is these clothes clips. Now, my kids always say, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Well, I'll tell you this, my kids don't have a sense of time, okay? So, I created these clips. I'm going to go on my visor. Now, I'm... I'm going to Hershey Park and this time I'm going to put Hershey characters on there. So it's like six hour trip. So I have six of these. Okay. Now I just hot glued a picture of the characters on the back. You can do, um, you can do like words, you can do other pictures, anything like that, wherever you're going, that kind of thing. This costs me nothing guys. So you have the Hershey syrup. You have the Reese cups, you have the Hershey bar, and I laminated these just because the Hershey kiss, Miss Twizzler, and the Jolly Rancher. So I'm going to have all six of them up there and each hour, you know, say it's like five hours to go, I'll take one down. Four hours ago, I'll take one down. And so they don't have to say, are we there yet? They're just going to see it. So with all that i do give my kids prizes every hour okay so if they're good within that hour they get a prize okay now i do get these bags at the dollar tree and if you guys can see one has an l on it and one has an a on it one's for landon one's for aiden those are my boys names and i put number one on there because to be honest with you guys they're like the same thing on here, in here. So, um, I give them like little prizes at, I usually get the stuff at the Dollar Tree, you know. So, what I have in here, um, is these little sticky hands that they can just do that on the window kind of a thing. But yeah, I give them like six prizes on each hour. So, or one each hour. So, which is great. So I give them like little prizes on top of that. Anyway, um, Google image, like I spy games, matching games, um, anything like that. So, um, like the ones that say bingo on it, like the, um, like stop sign. Um, if you see a horse, that kind of thing, and they just exit. Those are great too, guys. Um, the only thing is where it's like, it's just highways, you know? So I don't really do that because going to Hershey Park is just highway. But anyway, I did I Spy Games this time. Now I did laminate these because you, I want to reuse these, you know? So, um, you just take a dry erase marker and you can wipe it right off. So this one is a matching game. And these are I Spy Games. They're like all different, to be honest with you. Like this one has words on it. I Spy A B, and you find a B. This one is how many books or how many pencils is there. You know, you find how many pencils are there. This one has there's there's like um, six cars. Find six cars. You know. And then of course I have this Star Wars one, which is really cool. How many green lightsabers there how many r2d2s is there you know that kind of thing so i thought that was really cool for aiden and you can always like google image like easy medium hard kind of a thing as well too um anyway with the i spy games i did this um i spy um container kind of a thing these are these are boss water bottles they're actually um pet water bottles so they're v-o-s-s -S. these are great for stuff like this um so what i did was i put like rice in here and i put these buttons in here now the buttons are all like bugs like there's like a fly there's a bee there's like a worm in there and the kids just like move this around they find them you know like you can see that one and there's a fly somewhere on there but yeah these are pretty cool and then i just like super glue the top of it 
so they can't open it. So these are so cool. I love these things. Um, I make a lot of these things. So I did that. And then um, these... Um, I love these containers. These containers are so cool. Um, they're photo containers. They're a dollar, maybe a little less than that at Michael's. But um, this one has um, a fish game in it. So I just used felt, um, a little glue, hot glue, and a paper clip. So what you do is you just... Um, the felt, you're going to like actually draw out a fish. I just freehand drew it and I just made a template for all of them. Now you're going to need two templates for each fish, guys. So you're going to do it like a sandwich. You're going to put the one felt on there. Then you can put the paper clip and then you're going to hot glue around and you're going to put the other felt on top of it. And then put a googly eye on it. Call it a day. Okay? So I made six of these. Um, super easy, guys. And then I just took a popsicle stick, I wrapped around a string, hot glued that, and I hot glued a big magnet to it. Now, I reused a magnet. You can actually get them at Joann's. But I just hot glued the string to the magnet and then I put a piece of felt on there as so. Super easy. Let me take a little fish. And look at it. Right? Cool. How cool is that? So. And then they can play fishing game, that kind of thing. They actually, this is one of their favorite games. I might have to make another pull though. So I did that. And then um, these things are a lifesaver. I know, it's a bunch of sponges. Probably the easiest one I ever made. I just took sponges and I cut them up as bricks. All different shapes kind of a thing. And what they do is they just stack them. They stack them. Crazy, right? This is probably one of their favorite, favorite ones. And you can get, um, you can get like these big sponges at the Dollar Tree. Um, the different colors, you can get like six of them for a dollar. The cheap, cheap ones, you know. But they do all their activities on this tray. They just stack them right up, you know. So if you guys... Um, didn't know about this tray. I just did this on our other video um, for the car accessory um, for road trips. This is a lifesaver. So all my kids do all their activities on here. Anyway, um, Legos. So Legos is a big one. Um, Aiden wanted to bring some Legos last year. And I'm like, how am I going to do this? So what I did was I just took a box from the Dollar Tree and they have these templates. These, um, where are these? Like the, the Lego, um, you know what I'm talking about. These things. But anyway, <laughs> um, they saw them at the Dollar Tree and I just mount it right on the back of this. So all he does is he takes this, takes this and this and puts them together and creates something on here. Super easy, guys. I mean, it stays right on. They're, they're not, um, I don't think they're the actual Lego um, brand for these template things, but they do work, if you guys can see that. So super easy, easy to do, that kind of thing. Anyway... Um, I created Play-Doh boxes, guys. I know. I'm crazy bringing Play-Doh. But I'll tell you this. My kids love Play-Doh. And they'll sit there and do it for hours. So, I got these containers at the Dollar Tree. You get these, like, little, um, what's it called? The little Play-Doh things. You get, them, like, a whole bag full of them with the scissors and everything for a dollar, right? So, I have that. I put some cars in here and I put some um, little dinosaurs. Get these at Dollar Tree. A whole bag full of them for a dollar. For some reason, my kids do like Play-Doh with and put the cars on the Play-Doh. And then they like to make volcanoes for the, for the animals. Now, I did not put the Play-Doh in here. So these little compartments, these four little compartments are going to have Play-Doh. So, and the Play-Doh is from the Dollar Tree. 
can't go wrong with the Dollar Tree, guys. And then, oh, I have this thing. This is really cool. So this is a spice container. Look at those little holes in there, right? So I just reused this, and I took off the label. I put washi tape around it, just give it, like, so it looks more fun. You take pipe cleaners for a little, little kid. And it'd be like a one to three year old, I would say. And my kid will do this for hours and just do that. It's the, it's like the easiest thing. I even brought pom poms last year and he would like, he would like put them in there and then dump it out, put them in and dump it out. Like even, you know, it's a sensory thing, you know? So this is what he does. He loves it. Super cheap, super easy, free can't go wrong. I already had the pipe cleaners, so I, I reuse a lot of pipe cleaners too, so that kind of thing. Anyway, last thing is felt, okay? Felt books. Now, you can get these books at um, Target for like three bucks, which is amazing deal, I think. You know, these are travel busy books. You know, you have like tic-tac-toe and create a picture, that kind of thing. Um, but they have all like the little, you know, all the stuff in there. You can, there's like a puzzle in there and stuff like that. But before they had this, cause I did see this with the food and everything. I thought that was really cool. Look at that, the gumballs and stuff like that. And the taco. Before they had that, I actually created my own. And I just took felt and I... I just Google like an image, like ice cream, like ice cream image template. Okay. And this is, these are the, the scoops, right? Look at how cool, right? And my kid did this for hours and here's the cone. It's just made out of felt. And all I did was trace it and I cut it. That's it. You know? So my kid always does this and then um like the patty and here's the bottom and here's the meat and here's the cheese and the tomato let's see what else i got oh and the pickles and then you put the patty on top of it my kids love doing this kind of stuff so that was always a win for that and i just put in one of these things and you guys that is it yes that is it i want to make sure yes that is it and thanks for watching i hope you like these um give me a thumbs up if you do and if you didn't subscribe subscribe and we'll see you in our next video bye guys see you later